You know, if you're pulling through the drive through at the Chick-fil-A in Red Oak, you might see that smiling face. But when he's not there, Troy Grant is a musician working hard to get on a much bigger stage. And after Hannah Davis happened to walk by one of his concerts, she told us she had to do a story. She was just curious what was going on with this young man because it's just a matter of time until he's a household name. Take mm -hmm. a listen. Oh, oh, oh. Troy Grant has a voice that stops people in their tracks. Gotta find my way back. Grant just turned 20, and believe it or not, he hasn't been holding this guitar very long. Yeah, my junior year of high school, I started actually learning. When you find your destiny, things seem to fall in love. If it was meant to be. Every part of the world has some kind of music. So it's so universal that it's like, if you can make something that touches other people's heart in that way, then it's it's usually great. Was the night in shining armor in your movie? He's creating his own unique sound, forged from a story that hasn't always been upbeat. People always use music as their escape. My pain razor. Now find comfort in my pain. It was his mom Tasha who always saw a star on the rise. I'd come home after school and she'd be watching American Idol or something. And she'd be like, you're gonna, you're gonna do that one day. And then I'd be like, oh, okay. Five years ago, Troy's mom died in a car accident. It was the most painful day of his life. My mom was my best friend. Like, we were very, very close. But then he says he heard his mom's spirit telling him to go on the catalyst to step on stage. I'm only going over but my dad always told me that she always saw the name Troy Grant like in lights. And now crowds are seeing what Troy's mom did from day one. Oh. A voice that can bring people together. I want to accomplish my dreams for me, but I also want to accomplish what her dreams for me were. And a name we won't oh. soon forget. She wanted Troy to grant to be a household name, so that's, that's what we're gonna do. <laughs> thank you, thank you. That's what we're gonna do, and I totally believe him. Kara, you were asking me how I found this story. Mm -hmm. So I was down in Bishop Arts, kind of tooling around, having fun. I see this guy, he is amazing. I didn't have my phone or my camera with me. I hopped on a bird scooter, <laughs> zoom zoomed like my hair flowing in the wind, came back and started shooting the story. I was like, I'm not missing this. It was one of those moments you just knew. You never know when Hannah's going to show up and capture your story. Here, here's the thing too that that little area that you were that you were watching him yeah. sing. I've been over there before. This is a good spot to hear some fresh talent. And it, this is just right on the corner over there on on is it on Bishop? It's on yeah, it's on Bishop Street. It's right on the corner. They have great great artists. And one thing that I did tell him, I said we have to make a deal when not if when you win your Grammy, I get the exclusive. All right, and for those of you who live <laughs> over there. When the crowds get out of control and you need to call a police for crowd control, it's Hannah's fault. <laughs> yeah. They're Monday. already starting to push out into the street I'll there. I'll do crowd control on the bird scooter. Okay, you got it. Thanks, Hannah. <laughs> he was great. Uh, do you have a fussy eater? Parent